All right, so this is going to be a PVZ. This is Taldarim Altar. It's going to be per Bird Kicker, who is our reigning champ, the king of the hill. Lunatone is going to be the challenger. See if he can take the crown away. This is GSL version of Taldarim Altar. So there are no rocks at the third base. Makes it really easy to take that base. Don't even need units to be able to take that base. Here is Lunatone PKM spawning as the blue Protoss player. His opponent will be the orange Zerg player. Uh, Bird Kicker. Good luck, have fun, says uh, Bird Kicker. So we'll see what kind of strategy they decide to use on this map. This is cross map positions on Taldarim. YouTube buddy says uh, Lunatone. Let's take a look at the APM tab. Looks like Bird Kicker is destroying it with 300 APM as of the moment. Production just shows workers getting produced. Always a good thing to do. Looks like the probe is going to move out here, going to probably produce a pylon over here, going to be walling off to be able to get that 15 nexus, I imagine. Uh, we were talking about that earlier on this map. It's very good to get a 15 nexus. Um, uh, Bird Kicker here, you're going to continue to mine away. We've got the overlords going to be spreading out across the map. That uh, probe is going to be checking in this position of first. Again, this is the king of the hill. This is, the, I guess, the kickoff event for announcing the uh, American Pro League. I guess I could find a better name for that, but there's no good name for it as of yet. So we're just going to call it that for now. Um, go and check that out at mocktechcorp.net slash APL. You can sign up a team of at least three players. We're going to be playing all summer long. See if we can get some really good games. It's going to be best of th uh, fives team games. So go ahead and sign yourselves up there on that website. If, um, if you do want to play in this, we've got the Forge coming up for a Lunatone, so he will be able to grab his natural expansion relatively quickly. There's a spawning pool coming up for Bird Kicker as well. Pylon going down. Uh, so it looks like he's going to be um, expanding probably around 18-ish food. Um, see if he decides to do that. The probe is sort of just like scouting around. There is an overlord parked here. Going to be uh, checking out what's going on. The probe is going to be moving over here. We'll see if it decides to throw any cannons down. And looks like there's going to be a... Pylon getting thrown up right now, so Bird Kicker is going to have to pull some drones over here, see if he can uh, kill those off. Another probe also joining the fray. Uh, Lunatone is being very aggressive here right now. He's going to have to throw down um, a cannon sometime soon. That uh, did just finish now, the Pylon. And there's the first Photon Cannon getting thrown down. Two Photon Cannons throwing down. The drones are going to be milling around over here. You're going to try to take out that cannon. Of course, you can always cancel and build another one. More photon cannons going down. Bird Kicker really wants to get his natural expansion up. And uh, cancel going down on that first cannon. Um, but there's more cannons getting thrown up right now. Bird Kicker is going to start mining a bit at his natural expansion. It looks like he's going to actually let it finish. Um, there's the cannon getting canceled. That back cannon uh, is... Oh, man. More cannons getting thrown up. This is going to be a all-out cannon cheese. We've got that cannon in the back getting canceled once again. That cannon is complete now. Going to be shooting away at all of those zerglings. Looks like another cannon is finished over here. The probes do get taken out. That second cannon is going to help this other cannon take out a lot of zerglings. This hatch is complete. That one cannon is get taken out. There's a, an overlord over here will get taken out by that cannon shortly. This hatchery has been nullified. Lunatone also grabbing his own expansion nexus. Not actually built anything else as of the moment. Bird Kicker is supply blocked at 24 food. This hatch it might probably won't go down. He's producing a lot of zerglings as of the moment. There's a spine crawler coming up right now. And right now, we just see a Lunatone starting to go into a little bit more of a macro mode. That cannon is going to get surrounded by those Zerglings. And it finally does get taken out with six kills. And after denying the mining at this expansion for such a long time, Lunatone's expansion is about halfway complete. There is a Photon Cannon coming up over here. A hard wall off by that gateway. Let's just take a look at the units lost. Have the Lunatone has lost the bulk of majority of the... Uh, resources in this exchange um, 
<laughs> there's a reason why I don't hatch first on this map. I guess there's a tendency for people to try to do that. There's the Nexus uh, finishing up right now. Lunatone is going to throw down his Cyber Core. He's got both gases right now. Going to start mining from those right away. He's got the Zerglings advancing across the map. As essentially, I think Bird Kicker is clear now to take a very fast third base. We'll see if he decides to do that or decide to do something else. Another cannon coming up for Lunatone. He doesn't know exactly what our Zerg opponent is, a Zerg friend is doing over here. What his a Zerg opponent is doing over here. There's a hatch. There's, I mean, a gas coming up. The creep spread now starting to uh, spread out across the map. And there's a Nexus. I'm um, gonna begin the, the mining. There's a Stargate on the way. So, um, depending on how well Bird Kicker scouts that, it's going to be a very interesting game. See if we can get out Phoenixes, see if he can get out some Void Rays to do a lot of damage. This is a very interesting build here that we're seeing. Cannon Rush, Expand, Stargate. So we also have the Warp Gate research on the way. Um, nothing of the sort such as uh, going straight for the plus one and getting a, f a Fleet Beacon. That would be way too crazy. Lunatone grabbing the assimilator over here. Uh, the pylon is going to reinforce over here for those two cannons. The sentry is also out on the field. Looks like Bird Kicker is opting to make tons and tons and tons and tons of drones. It's 45 harvesters to so 41, so Lunatone is actually quite even on that field right now. A void rate is pr being produced right now. The lair is also on its way. This creep thread is beginning to make its way over to the natural expansion. The Roach Warren is now complete. Zerglings giving good spawning at the Zelnaga Watchtowers, and uh, the first Roid Ray is about to finish up right now. More gateways getting thrown down by Lunatone. A, a robotics facility also coming up, and it looks like the uh, Warp Gate research is about to get completed. The first Void Ray is now making its way across the map. Will get spotted by that Zergling, so there will be some time for him to re uh, react. The Phoenixes are getting Chrono boosted out. Again, Phoenixes are very fast to produce. There's the first one. Another Phoenix is on the way. We'll see how uh, he's going to respond to this. Looks like more Queens are getting produced at the hatches. For uh, Bird Kicker, he's probably going to have to throw down a, a Hydralis Den, maybe a Evo Chamber to get some Spore Crawlers to hold against this. Here's the Phoenix and the Void Ray going to be moving over here. That Queen is vulnerable. We'll see if it's able to do uh, the damage necessary. And here comes the lift on that Queen. That uh, Void Ray is going to be able to charge up on her and even take her out right now. Phoenixes are continuing to move across the map right now. Um, looks like this avoid rate is going to get ranged down on by that a queen. It looks like a transfuse just went down on that queen. The uh, queen is trying to do maximal damage. That queen does not go down. It's got 5 HP left. Uh, Lunatone almost losing that void ray. He's going to have to um, do something to come back in this game. He's got to have uh, more gateways coming up. Another void ray is in the production queue. Almost got that queen. A very sad day for the Protoss army indeed. There's a third hatch out on the field for Bird Kicker now. We'll be able to saturate that relatively quickly. Lunatone actually still keeping up in terms of food. The Phoenixes are going to be moving out across the map. Going to be able to poke away at these uh, overlords. Maybe take a couple out. Uh, Bird Kicker is going to be advancing forward with his uh, Hydras. Oh, Lunatone might not be paying attention. He's going to lose one of his Phoenix. Looks like um, that one other Phoenix is going to be able to scout this expansion. The Hydras are going to be pulling back. A, a Colossus Den is also on the way so Lunatone is pushing steadily towards that death ball um, the uh, void ray over here not quite paying attention to that overseer looks like it does not quite get taken out one more shot it goes down it does see the Colossus then now out on the field there should be some kind of response there is the spire coming up we'll be able to get corruptors in just a hundred some seconds there are void rays out on the map though that Colossus is getting Chrono Boosted right now, as well as the plus one uh, ground armor. That Void Ray from Initial that was uh, unable to kill that Queen is uh, hanging out over here. Um, where is that Queen that has very low health? There it is, uh, 39 HP. couple of Hydras over here going to be guarding that expansion. Going to be killing off that wall and probably moving out right now. A couple of Zerglings are going to be able to spot this move out. And Zerglings are also going to check for a third base. Bird Kicker is still... Uh, even basically even in terms of food so let's take a look at the army tab looks like lunatone is leading it in the army supply count bird kicker now making a couple more army units right now 
And it looks like Lunatone is moving across the map with his army. We'll see how much damage he is able to do if he is able to end this game with this push at all. The Phoenixes have scouted this expansion over here, so he knows that that is in existence. Extended Thermal Lance has just been started. Bird Kicker over here going to be producing a lot of roaches. Gleo Reconstitution, Zerg Missile Attacks Level 1 now finishing up. Looks like they're going to come over here and possibly force a cancel on that hatch. Um, Bird Kicker might let this finish. We'll see if he decides to do that. And the cancel goes down. The uh, minerals have been recouped. The uh, Protoss army is going to ball up again. Maybe make a move over here. Overlords are starting to spread out all across the map. Um, Stalker's over here checking for anything, and a probe is going to be throwing down that natch, that third base. Bird Kicker at 174 food right now. Lunatone is going to um, be a little bit behind in terms of food count because of that third base. Uh, however, again, Bird Kicker is maxing on this Roach Hydra composition. If a Protoss just balls up really, really hard, he should be able to win against this. The uh, Void Rays continuing to get pumped out by Lunatone is getting that very strong Death Ball composition. Uh, is, the, is there a Twilight Council c getting produced right now? There it is, Twilight Council. We will really get the plus two upgrade. There is a Zergling at this, a Zelnaga Watchtower. Lunatone is going to be building a couple pylons in the center. Going to be making sure that he can reinforce a lot easier. Colossus are continuing to join this army. This expansion will come up real soon. Uh, Bird Kicker is uh, almost max at 192 food, but it is a Roach Hydra, a couple of Corruptors popping right now, but there are a plenty of Void Rays in the air to be able to kill those off very easily. More Colossus getting produced right now. Looks like Zerg has got a couple of Corruptors. A lot of Roaches going to be advancing forward. Lunatone is a, his army is a little bit split up right now. He's going to be coming over here. Looks like they cross paths. And uh, Lunatone is out of position. His Colossus is way in the back. Great force field is going to be sealing that off very easily. Wow, I thought he was going to lose those Colossus very easily over there. Bird Kicker is going to lose a couple of units in that exchange. Uh, Pronos is going to ball up over here. The Corruptor is going to uh, start doing some damage over here. Looks like the uh, Zerg army is moving into position to just try to cut off any reinforcements. Looks like Lunatone is trapped in this position. The Roach Hydra composition is going to be able to take this out. Uh, more Void Ray is going to be joining this uh, composition over here. The Colossus doing great amounts of damage against those Hydras, but the Roach is killing everything off that one Colossus over there is going to be able to win the fight. The uh, Hydras are reinforcing that uh, uh, one Colossus does get taken out. More reinforcements over here for Lunatone, but uh, his Death Ball has been nullified. And Zerg looks like he's going to be taking a, a, a very big lead right now, 200 food to 124. Lunatone is going to be falling here. Uh, he's got his uh, third expansion up and running, but he's got to get his death ball back up. He's got four more gateways coming up. His money is getting a little bit high right now. He's got more Colossus on the way, more Void Rays getting pumped out right now. Here comes the push. There's no sentries in this composition, so the Phoenix is going to start shooting away at that Corruptor. Um, not much in terms of a anti-Colossus composition over here. Looks like more Zealots getting warped in right now. A couple of Roaches getting lifted. The Hydra's reinforcing the uh, one Colossus over here with four kills. Five kills now. They're going to try to keep backing up here. It does get taken out. Uh, Lunatone at 110 food. These Gateway is trying to warp in as many units as he possibly can, but his money is getting quite low. Here comes some Stalkers going to be advancing forward. There's that Colossus popping out. More Void Rays in the composition, you know, pulling it forward. But Bird Kicker has taken out the expansion over here. He's uh, even uh, pushing into the main right now. The Roach is just kind of crowding in. That Void Ray quickly getting melted away by those Hydras. Down it falls. The Colossus getting queued up right now. All of the Roach is starting to take out these unit buildings. Lunatone saying GG. Bird Kicker maintains the throne.